Now, what we have seen is just the pointer variable storing the address. And now the question is, how can we, how can we go ahead and ask C language or ask the compiler that, hey, you know, um, uh, this address here, yeah, go to that and then fetch me the contents within it. Otherwise, why even have pointer if you cannot manipulate the memory location here, right? And the way that is done is by using asterisks or the star symbol when using the variable. Again, let me go back and restate a difference. When you use a star while defining or declaring, and the difference we haven't talked about defining and declaring, um, while defining or declaring a variable, when you use a star, the variable becomes a pointer. And when you use a star with the, with the variable name elsewhere, it means, hey, this, this pointer variable, whatever address that was pointing to, you actually get the contents of that. And this is very critical, by the way. If you, I, I would request you to watch this video again if you haven't understood this one fundamental point, right? And let me go ahead and demonstrate what that means. So I'll keep things as is, except I'll kind of go ahead and make this a star, make this a star, and I'm going to make one final change. So we are now saying, hey, whatever the address CPTR was holding, we want you to go to that location and get the contents and the contents are of the type character. That is what the data type here denotes. You know, this data, data type here is telling the compiler that CPTR is going to point to a location that has a character. And that is why what we'll do is change this, uh, change this person P here to person C. And let's save it. Now let's run this. And if you see, star PTR here is A, right? And let me, you know, just hammer the point home, which is C wasn't, was at an address in this case, 67F dot 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 something. Then there was CPTR um, and CPTR also held the address um, uh, 67F. Uh, which is, uh, you know, this and uh, C itself was the content was A. And then when, when we did star C underscore PTR, it just meant, hey, go to this location and fetch the contents from inside of it. And that is this, right? This is absolutely crucial in terms of, you know, the, the, the dance of stars and ampersands. And we'll continue to see this again and again, and, and I'll reiterate how to use and uh, what they mean. But remember, brain tattoo it. Uh, whenever during declaration or definition of a variable, we use a star with it, the variable becomes a pointer, which will point to the data of this type, the data types, right? And whenever we use star, space or without space, the 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 variable's name it means hey whatever the address the variable the pointer variable is storing go to that location and read that location as if there was this data data type stored there a character was stored there right and uh, anytime we use ampersand in front of a variable name uh, it gives us the address of that variable and um, yeah pretty much i think that's enough for now uh, as part of this video